to food preparation and nutrition. This is how the course is structured over the two years you've been practicing and training to cook and develop your catering skills. So in year 10, we'll be developing and improving skills, learned in key stage three, building on more technically challenging recipes. Food, prepar food preparation, nutrition students will continue to grow and extend their knowledge on the core topics of this course, which are food nutrition and health, food science, food safety, food choices, and food provenance. In year 11, food nutrition students will be preparing to complete the two practical and written assessments for this course. These are non-exam assessments, or NEAs for short. How this course is assessed? You have one written exam, which is one hour and 45 minutes, which is 50% of your final grade. This comprises of 20 multiple choice questions and five questions, which total 80 marks. You have one written assessment, which is 10 hours of supervised study. This is a food investigation. For example, is gluten needed for the formation of a good bread dough? This is 15% of your overall final grade. And you have one practical assessment, which is 20 hours long, which is also supervised study, where you have to prepare, plan, prepare, and cook three dishes in three hours, which meet a particular dietary requirement. For example, cook three dishes suitable for a teenager. This is 35% of your final GCSE grade.